Hey, this is Mark at the Monroe Pop Fest. I'm here with Power Ranger Blake Foster. How you doing, bud? I'm doing good. How you doing? I'm getting by. <laughs> Tell us, how did you get started with the Power Rangers? Um, I was actually uh, filming an independent film at the time, and I was 12, and I was a black belt. And the director of the film that I was filming was the producer of Power Rangers. I had no idea. He was an Israeli guy. His name was Shuki Levy. Um, I'm messing around one day on set, just being a kid, throwing karate kicks and doing flips and stuff like that. And he comes up to me and he goes, Blake, would you want to be a Power Ranger? And I said, what do you know about Power Rangers? I grew up on Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I was like, ah, this guy doesn't know what he's talking about. He doesn't even know Power Rangers. Next thing I knew, I was at a casting table, uh, table reading, and I was casted. There was no audition process. They gifted me the role of Justin Stewart, the Blue Turbo Power Ranger. Now, were you, like, considered the youngest Power Ranger? I was. I was the only kid Power Ranger in history, yeah. 12 years old. When I morphed, I grew. I got a little bit bigger. But, yeah, I was the only kid Power Ranger. What was some of your best favorite experiences doing doing that? I have a lot. I mean, I grew up in a martial arts dojo, so anything on television that was karate-based was my thing. And Power Rangers was super cool. They morphed. They got in these cool suits. Um, I'll never forget the day that I'm sitting... Um, sitting on a boat in the middle of the ocean we called it the ghost galleon and um i got to do a fight scene and they had these big these big guys they were like i think they were called um putrepods at the time the big characters right and um i got to kick them as hard as i could because i was 12 i didn't really have much power behind me at that age but these guys went flying off the boat and it was just a lot of good times on power rangers honestly i, I did a lot of fun stuff on power rangers did you ever get hurt I never got hurt. I did a lot of my own stunts. I will say that um, it's very draining as a kid doing all that stuff. And then at the same time, trying to hit your mark and still be professional. So I had my moments where I would slip up and goof off as a kid. But um, for the most part, I, I, did, I did my thing. I did, my, I, did a good, I did a good job. What are you doing these days? Um, I'm actually now an MMA fighter. I just had my pro MMA debut back in September in Utah. And I, got, I, I won the 205 uh, light heavyweight belt. Um, I knocked him out the first round. I have another fight coming up in January on a show called Freedom Fight Night that's on Hulu, um, hosted by the United Fight League. And um, I'm a dad. I got two kids. I married my wife, and uh, we're living life. My son's a jiu-jitsu uh, star. He's, he's doing really good and competing in all these world tournaments. We're doing it together, and, yeah, we're in the studio night and day. We train five days a week, and uh, we're out here kicking butt. Do you enjoy coming to these conventions? I do. I really do enjoy coming to these conventions. Like I said before, I was a fan of Power Rangers before I was on the show. So I relate to a lot of these fans. And I know what it's like to come up to a table and be like, starstruck. You know, oh my God, you were on Power Rangers. I relate to them well because I know what it's like. Because I was the same way as a 12-year-old kid when I got to meet Jason Frank. Or when I was sitting at that table reading and I got to meet all the Power Rangers. Would you ever go back to this uh, show? Yeah. A hundred percent. Yeah. We've been trying to get me back on the show for quite some time now. It's just been, um, hit or miss. I've, I've had a kid. They, didn't, they were going to bring back for the super mega force battle. I was having a son at the time, so I couldn't really participate in that. And now I'm doing my MMA career. So I'm a little, really, really booked at the moment. Um, I'm booked all the way up until January of next year. So I would love to go back on the show if they offered me the opportunity again, for sure that the kids would love to see it. The fans would love to see it. I mean, the franchise and the fandom behind it. They all want to know whatever happened to that little 12-year-old kid that morphed and had superpowers. So I think it could be a pretty cool storyline if they did something with it. So it was a pleasure speaking with you, Thank Blake. You so much, and this is Mark at the Monroe Pop Fest with the Power Ranger.